Hello, this is Irian from Variety Games UK, and this is me continuing weapon tests, but this time we are no longer doing the Ranger. We've finally finished the Ranger, so it's on to the next. So let us go across. And get the ball rolling. This should be a lot quicker than Ranger because it's a quicker class we're doing, so that's a plus. And then we're going to go back to 2D Tuesday. I just want to get these out over and done with now. Um, and there's a lot of them to get through. No, that's wrong. That's wrong. Already, that's wrong. So we want Mutant Rampage Select offline on player mode. Class and equipment. Chief I've test I've actually made player. sure to test it this time to make sure it works and it works beautifully. So we're going with a wing diver. We're starting with rapier. Or rapier, whatever you wanna however you want you wanna pronounce it. Is this how we're starting? You would think Deploying. it'll Select take a while. A it's not actually that bad. Select a so let's do it. Giant robots is the one we're doing. There'll be a load of trying to attack, trying to actually jump on drones later on, but that's just how that goes. This is headquarters. Argo is coming. Got it. Yes, sir. Argo or not go? We're gonna find out. Trying up some drones out already. Note the try, because this is an amazingly sharp weapon. We kind of gone off the beaten path just to do that. Dive bomb! Well, you would put your shield in the way, wouldn't you? That didn't work and it's in 4.1 so we can't actually... I found out shooting them in the foot works beautifully. Like so. Right, we got the one there. Let's go get it. Is the move quicker than I do? And I'm not flying. Can you stop moving, please? There we go. Stop battering me away with your gun. Thank you very much. This will be a lot easier in 4.1. Just with them improvements. Wow. I think we've also got the Argo shooting us. Kind of hoping the Argo won't be a pain in the ass. Alright, so there's no robots attacking them yet. Let's go take out the robots, then they can take out the drones. Let's make them effective. I'll just fly around the map. Slip out. Come on, you can get up. There we go. Stand right there. There we go. 
I mean, I would eat, I would, I'm not even going to mint. Well, oh, we need to get our robot before it kills anybody over that. Ow. Yako does not like me even attempting this. <laughs> so I'm like the ranger. Like, I can get close enough, but then I get batted away. Like, proper flying away. Alright, let's try and kill some drones while we go to attack Argo. Or at least weaken them a little bit. There we go. And we've got a hope. He is in range, because it's going to be a pain in the ass if he isn't. Because this is an extremely short range weapon. Oh, what a pain in the ass. He is actually out of range. Let's kill some drones then. Wow. Thank you, Indiana Cones, for the epic hooks. No, the double epic hooks vampire in the battlefield. Very much appreciate it. There we go. Another one down. Ah! Should I wait for Mr. Robot to come a bit closer? She might be doing. The problem is, is taking out the um, allies. I think he might have come close enough now. No, he hasn't. Still hasn't come close enough. If anything, he's gone further back. His um, weapons are close enough. We need him to walk forward a little bit more. Thank you, just now for the epic GNFX virus shadow colliding on the battlefield. Very much appreciated. Much gotta dodge him until he comes closer. On the test, he didn't stand outside the map. This is just a really unlucky start. If I can clear the drones, then the EDF can actually help. The problem is, as we can see, is the drones can be pretty high at times. But he's still out of the range.
One more drone, and then maybe I can grab the rest of the EF troops. Take them further away, and maybe that thing's got maximum range and has to come out. That's hoping. To pull that thing out. I'm not entirely sure it does have a maximum range. Here's hoping. Unfortunately, them guys aren't moving. It seems to move forward a bit. Or does it move forward enough? I don't think so. No. Absolutely miles away, that thing. Mistaken, that's the road we need to it to be in. Just waiting, Kevin, hoping this works and we pull it into the map. But, problem is, the other EDF group still has the commander. Oh! Thank you, Seraphin, for the epic and the high bomber on the battlefield. Did you really just time that out yourself? Very much appreciated, especially the timing out. Man. <laughs> oh, I feel bad when it does that. I'm playing that game again. And the robot's been annoying. <sighs> is he still miles out the screen? I think. I'm pretty sure this is the road that I can get to. <laughs> you wish. You wish. Nah, the robot is still out of range, unfortunately. I do not wish, to be honest. Wow, what do you want a 24 hour stream of? You know, I could pick up the items actually. Pick up the red boxes, we get a bit of health. Which, for the wing diver, is probably a good thing. Probably easier just to restart and just aim straight for him and just take him out. Oh, is he actually coming now? 
Ah, uh, that's where we'll be. I'll never play the same game. Alright, let's try this again. Let's restart the mission, hope he comes closer. And we'll just go straight for the Argo. <sighs> we stopped doing 24 hour streams of the same game years ago. We completely agree. I think the for the Forza <laughs> the Forza fiasco was the last time. Alright. So we've taken everything else out, we just need to take him out on a successful test. And he's actually close enough this time. Great, goes in the air. And stamps on the floor. And the ass. I think the 24 hour stream is going to be so random, even I don't know what's happening. I don't think any of us know what's happening yet on that. Oh god, the other help robots are helping. As usual. The joys of the okay, being such a close range weapon. These are going to fall over a lot. Seraphim! Hello! You are the only host today, right? Oh, yeah. I'll get on it. <laughs> I'll get on it. Uh, calm down, Argo. Calm down. Oh, we're damaging quite a bit, actually. Won't be long until we can. I was too focused on getting into the stream. <laughs> oh my god, stop shooting me. Stop shooting me! There is a heat more in chat, guys! Exclamation mark, boat catch if you want it. Where is the. Ow! I just need his legs. I'm on it. I'm just getting swatted out the sky by a big robot at the moment. Wow. Pretty much instantly swatted. <laughs> Get up. Shoot it. Shoot my leg. Oh my god. What am I getting swatted by every five seconds? There's no robots around either. I'll go as a knight. Bloody hell, I'll go. Let me just get close. I'm nearly dead. I'm on it, it's all good. Oh my god. He is repent. He is repentant this time. Relentless. Can you not do that? Wing diver. There we go, our goes down, we can, do, we can call that successful now. It's all good to spam right. Yeah, because you know something, I've realised. None of the exclamation mark battles and stuff come up in chat, so... Uh, 
You can't with one if you're spamming. Well, it doesn't take. It doesn't stop the concentration. I only needed to kill Diago, so. The next weapon is the laser lance, which we'll test after this stream as well. Sorry about that, Seraphin. I just couldn't seem to get up because the absolute pain in the ass, which Diago was being. Alright, so, oh wow, Cell's on the battlefield. High ground it is. It looks like Cell's got a machine gun on its arm. I don't think Cell ever came with a machine gun. Pew pew pew! Look at him flying around. And got Seraphin at the top, wiping everything out as well. And me. That's a bit too hot at the moment. So here we go, we've got a bronze chest, thanks. And special congratulations to everyone, but the extra congratulations to Seraphim, 10 gold, and Mirrored in the Cat for 3 times Rogue Scrolls. Congrats, guys. Unfortunately, there's a few bronzes to get through. We're going up top so we can get the gold chest, but unfortunately, there's another bronze, but this area is just full of bronze. That's the problem we've got. Bronze, bronze everywhere. Not enough time standing there. So, let us place a... We can place a Berserker. Place a level... 30 Berserker, no I don't see the point of that actually. What else we got? Centurions and Mages. Okay. We'll place a Berserker. <laughs> it's like I don't know what to place. If you're roying um, Seraphim, no, Book of Demons is still happening later. 2D Tuesday is still a thing. I just want to get these bloody weapon tests done. <laughs> Thank you, Conqueror of Chaos, for the epic Pyro Ishii Shinobi on the battlefield. Very much appreciate. Let's get back to it, and we can get through these weapons quicker. Just hopefully, the Argo doesn't be a pain in the ass and dodge this time and hide out the map. Select a mission. Select a difficulty. Don't know how any of these weapons work, so as usual, I'm going to get swatted away like no one's business. So luckily, the rep rapier, rapier, whatever you want to call it, has been tested successfully. Okay, this... Sounds like a bit of a weird weapon. Oh, he's coming straight down, is he? I thought this was going to be a... Okay, it's a one-shot weapon. Ow! Don't even know what happened there. It's got flung. Probably his fault. Yago is actually in the battle this time, you can tell. See anything? There's too many. There's too many. There's a machine gun in my face. That's probably why. Me away with your bullets, with your weapons, please. There we go. Managed to get through them two robots. 
Don't even know where the big guy's gone. Oh, he's retreated a little bit. Of course he has. Let's help take out the rest of the robots then. Ow. Shooting out the air. Behind the shield, of course. Just one more robot got down. Luckily, this laser lance does a lot of damage. Alright, let's see if we can take out the Argo. Probably taking that drone out on the way as well. Unfortunately, these are a lot of close range weapons. And we're not getting slung around when he does his annoying attacks. Every shots, these do 200 damage, I like one thing. So we do about 2000 damage each time shots. So technically, this shouldn't really take damage as long as you get the shots here. Great, I see what you're doing. Yep, I knew that was going to be. Got it. Alright, now is time for these guys. We took out quite a few in the air, but then we ran out of air. Ran out of power. short range there. But we've only got four left. Yeah. 
Number one. There we go. I think the EDF took the other one out. There was four. Right, also, let's take the other hosts off the list. <laughs> Seraphim did tell me about that as well, but I forgot about that part. Right. Your o host is unfortunately just here in today. Not as funny as yesterday, not going to be as many as much singing, but you know. Depends what happens at the time, whether I sing or not. Sometimes I do. Right, so now we've got another one. It's not really much of an improvement over the last one, so... Uh... I think it just fires a bit more straight. Deploying. Select a mission. Select a difficulty. Trying higher difficulties can re I don't have any pirate 2D games, I don't think. This is headquarters. Argo is coming. Oh no way. Monkey Island is technically a 2D game. I don't think I've got that installed. Ah. Yeah, I know a load of those games actually. Okay. Yeah, that's a lot more focused. Oh, and he's, he's actually approaching this time. Good. Argo's already annoyed. That screen shake. No, we did kill it. We killed the robot, even though I wasn't entirely sure. Oh, Argo's right next to us, apparently. Can you stop battering me around with your gun? I don't know where you are. Ow. Expect Pirate song to sing. There is a cell going, chat guys, exclamation mark, poke catch if you want it. Is that the last robot? I think it was. Oh no, there's still a robot coming down the middle. Okay. Don't know where that one came from. Trying to shoot us out of the sky. Not happy about that. Not impressed. There we go. Okay, this version is a lot better. Just because of the version, just because of the facts, the beam is a lot closer and it's not all over the place. So why don't it actually take us as well? Because we don't, don't have to get as close. Still can help us not get hit repeatedly. Problem with these close range weapons. I'll be right up next to him. You don't like it when you're shooting right next to him. Uh, 
And she only moves. What the hell happened there? He just forced us back with his leg. I tried to avoid that, that didn't go too well. Whoa, we're just getting... Okay, the wing diver seems to get hit a lot more than a ranger did. I'm gonna enjoy being in that. Oh no, the tank's gonna get blown across the map as well with the air raider. <laughs> Helicopters can be even funnier. I don't think we're doing the helicopters on this map though. Ship missions! He mangled his leg away. How cruel the Argo is. So good at aiming. At least seems to be, because every single time we try and fly, he just directly nails us. I don't know if we're flying into him though, that's the problem I suppose. Gotta be close to that. stood on me. There we go, the Argo is down. Finally. Can't wait to get off these earlier weapons. I mean, it's, at least it's not a torch. Could always be worse. Cut it off at the pass. We can. Crap. And that'll boost and ammo at the same time then. Used to air battles in a wing diver. Usually, I use longer range weaponry. It's one of us, I think. No. I realise it's right there. power to go that high at the moment. That's 
There we go, another weapon test complete. That was the Rapier Thrust, or Rapier Thrust. Choose loadout. Done Lace Lance, Rapier, Rapier, and Rapier Frost. Next we've got Lance, Laser Lance B, it, which doubles the damage and actually increases the range of the last one. It just takes a little bit longer to fire. But all the weapons double the damage, so... We're getting to the part where it's just going to go quicker and quicker each time. The problem is there's a load of these. Choose loadout. Wing divers can equip. But I feel like the list is gonna quickly accelerate because some of them weapons do ridiculous damage. Since we're playing the wing diver, Deploy it's going a lot quicker if the robot isn't out in the difficulty. arena. For that easy thing that we can just fly. Right, robots first. That's the good thing. The wing diver is the fastest class. The problem is we get knocked down for quite a long time. There we go. And as you can tell that double damage is paying off already. What the hell just happened there? I'm teleporting. Robot down. Yep, I felt like it was going to shoot me. Wow. Way then. Where's the other robot gone? There. Take out these ones first. Reduce their effectiveness. There's a raid in chat! Exclamation mark raid if you want to join. One down. Now just the big robot to go. I double the damage, this shouldn't take too long. Technically 4,000 damage each 10 shots. And with the extra range, it's not as bad to hit. The problem is he can still blast us because stupid needs a lot of short range. It'd be easier to dodge when we've got longer range weapon, right? Thank you! KCMC Monster. The epic stream artillery on the battlefield, very much appreciate. I 
half is actually made. There we go, R goes down, and now we can get shooting some drones. That was a lot quicker. don't prefer the lance for anti-air. Yeah. Uh, probably shoot some without even leaving the ground. It's not many. Probably pretty much directly above me. The plus we've got is we're not restricted to the ground, so... Unlike the other classes, if they've got short range weapons, I can't really do a lot about it. That's why the wing diver's kind of perfect for this mission. You know, on the rare occasion drones actually hit the floor like that one, but very rare. Where's the last one? Directly above us. Cross it is. And quite far up as well. Boosh! Last one down. So that could be KC Mid Monster. I think I missed that one. Alright. Next weapon, that was the Laser Lance B. The next weapon is the M2 Rapier. Choose loadout. Wing divers can equip two weapons. So now we're up to level 10 weaponry. I feel like this one shoots everywhere as well though, so. I'm going to make it a lot quicker, it's as spread out as the first one. With the same range and... There's a clan pearl in chat guys, exclamation mark poke catch if you want it. It's kind of the same dealio with the other one. Let's get close. But considering it does two damage instead of one, it'll make it a lot easier. It's still not going to be easy. Especially considering Argo is right there this time. He just punched me with his arm. Congratulations on your Braxis Bow Seraphit. Realize was second robot. Did not realize the second robot stood right next to me. Stood on top of me. There we go. Right, so I think we've got one more little robot to take down, and then we've got the Argo. At least everything's going down a lot quicker again. I 
I really miss 4.1's quality of life upgrades. Not being able being able to get straight up from knockdown is great. Oh, Argo's down, okay. I didn't even realise. There we go. So, stream the battle will be done as soon as I clear up these few flyers. Won't take too long, though. I say that. This is really spread fire. And it's not as bad as the first one, to be fair. And luckily I've still got EDF soldiers so that'll wipe some of them out. I was looking for that one. I wasn't even looking for that one over there. I just flew past it. It's like playing a space game but with limited movement. <laughs> Trying to find the targets on the minimap. Netherland. I mean, we took out a few. Problem is, sometimes they're so high up, like this one. Choice about these all being such low range weapons. I've got to get exceptionally close. I wish I knew that one was so close. Oh my god, it's gone underneath me again. Oh no! Gun ran out. Zap the rest of my energy. Their turning circle isn't as good. As we saw by one crashing into a tree. She picked up an item in the middle of the air. Marvelous. Not like that's going to help us recharge our energy. One more to go, I think. Um, 
BDF got him. Right, so that was the M2. Rapier. We're going to go for the two way lance. The hell is a plasma ram? Oh, so it does charge. I'm glad that charges. Alright, two way lance is gonna be awful. <laughs> Wind divers can equip two weapons. And that is true. Battle is ready. We'll get that sorted before we start, of course. Choose loadout. Wind divers can Do not wanna forget that. Right, here we go. Ah, so it was KC McMonster. Okay. Just know that now. Right, with the main group, we're going to high ground. Whew. just defended the shrine. They're sneaking around from behind. Ah, uh, we're about to lose it. No, maybe not. Didn't realise there's still had a fighter over there. Oh, we defended it quite well. We managed to fight off the enemy. And we kept our position. Special thanks and congratulations go to... Bunnetic for Vampire Scroll and Seraphin Free Time Sank Scrolls. Congrats, guys. Alright, on to the next fight. It is a gold chest, a loyalty gold one. So make sure you're in to get some extra gold. And we are going to place... Centurion. We'll place him this side. There we go, thanks for helping out. And now it's time for the two way lance to show us its thing. Reduce firepower, it still does 500 damage, so as long as we can get close enough to things, we should be able to absolutely wreck everything. Quite efficiently, in fact. It'll take four shots to take out the little robots. It'll still take out quite. A, it'll still use quite a few to take out Argo, though. Should be four shots for them robots. Five five that time. Let's keep on the offensive this side. Yep, four shots. Massive I don't miss. Which I'm gonna do when I get launched across the screen. <laughs> Holy crap. Okay. Got proper launch across the screen then. When are we gonna stop? There we go, we stopped. We can move again. The great thing about EDF ragdolls.
Obviously not such a great thing at higher difficulties, but obviously you're not going to be this close to the enemies because you'll probably pick a weapon that isn't short range. Ow. Ow. Right, I was about to fly. That was the one I was picking on earlier. Just it seemed to die really quickly. My god, it just kicked me again. <laughs> I didn't know Hectors could give you a bit of a kick. All my years playing this game, I didn't realise they could kick you like that. I mean, I think they've done it to a tank before. It's one Hector. He just likes launching me. Not now he doesn't. Alright, let's get rid of this last one before he wipes out all the EDF troops. Well, let's at least try. Calm down, Argo. There we go. Alright. Time for the Argo. Now we've just got to figure out a nice place to attack him from. The most effective way. With this weapon being a V weapon, so it shoots in two different directions. But even though it says V shot, it doesn't actually have that much of a spread. But it'd be a lot more spread out. It can actually fire with some distance. Still not enough, but you know. You get this, which is a small V. Then you get like the uh, air, air raid, um, ranger guns, which are a massive difference. I thought it'd be a lot more like that. Marvelous. Doing a spinny move. There is a giraffe rig in chat, guys. If you want it, exclamation mark, boat catch. Oh wow, that is doing a lot of damage to him actually. He doesn't seem very happy about it though. Wow. It's not until you play the wing diver that you realise how much of a pain in the ass Arco actually is. I thought it was like impossible to dodge him with just the ranger. There's a uh, drone over here somewhere. There it is. Now let's go on this building. Get some of our energy back. Oh, the EDF just shot down on the drones, that makes it a lot easier for us. We probably only need to hit with one laser, so we don't have to worry too much about the drones.
Make sure we're all still on the building. It's kind of probably the easiest way to take on these guys. Keeps us at height, we don't have to use as much energy. Problem is, these two are far out. He's out of range, but we shouldn't need a lot of energy. Got him. And that's the two way lads. Weapon test complete. Next, the Plasma Ram. This will destroy all the smaller robots in one shot. This will also destroy... Um, what's his face? Argo in about eight. It's a powerful weapon. But how annoying is it to fire? That's going to be the question that we're going to find out. It's going to have some kind of shortcoming. How, he, how easy is it going to be for these things to block? I, flew, I kind of flew into his weapon there. That was a silly idea. Oh, Argo! Wow. Why? Oh, now I'm being shot from behind. Marvellous. Come on, get up, take that robot out. Come on, get it. Oh my god, no. Not out. Can't see now. Yep, one shot. That's all it takes. It's actually got a non right range. So there should be one robot left because we somehow pulled the other robot away as well. This is like the robot killer, this one. <laughs> in a massive robot. Oh, that's how. Decided to stomp. He's proper angry stomping. Well, he should be nearly dead already. many kills. Not many shots. There we go, he's down. I feel like this is going to be really bad for the anti-air though.
It does have a better range than the other guns. So I might actually be able to hit this one without even flying. Well, if we don't miss. Definitely hit that one. That one was extremely low. Oh yeah, we've got a pretty good range actually. We don't even need to fly with most of these. That one's too high. Okay, we found a uh, we found our limitation. It's not much of a limitation with how low these things come down though. Advantage is we can fly and miss. It's a good advantage. Well, that one we're gonna get if we can reload quick enough. We probably can't because we run out of energy as well as reload. We can. We can still get him. to reload a bit more before I do that. These two are both flying far away. There we go. The one down. So that was the Plasma Ram test complete. Next we have got Laser Lance R Custom. Close range battle, well that's what all these weapons are for. So let's try it. We're getting close, we're getting closer now to quick finishes. Especially after that laser lamp that Plasma ram. Did you eat lunch? This is headquarters. Argo is coming. We can win if we combine forces. We can't lose. Yes, sir. Hey, don't die. There is a Velaskia on the phone, I assume. Yep, it is. Hiya. Hiya. Oh, God, I got to Did that? Yeah. On the other back, yeah. Well, I think they might have gone now, unless they've flipped over. You think they'll try some door somehow? Well, they rang me, but I was there, and someone's answering. Answer? You think they'll realise the back gate that's not Never mind. How's your go how's your day going? Can I uh, date? Can I poke catch Velasquez on the phone now? Maybe. So if it Ah Wow. That's negative. Right, what time was that? That was a good phone call anyway. I accept you as you are, Velasquez. Much love. I'll probably have to repeat that again. Oh, 
Oh, okay, this is quite actually quite inaccurate. Assume this will be going a lot easier. Repeat it many times, Irian. I will do. Oh, I'll spam a river. I'll take a screenshot. Punch one more robot, then we can get on with the big guy. There we go. Thank you, Azzy87, for the epic Emerald Speed Start from the battlefield. Very much appreciate. There he is. Oh, it's got more capacity, I didn't realise that. Yep, we still can't dodge. Well, we definitely can't dodge that one. Thank you, Seraphim, for the double epic and the eye bomb on the battlefield. Very much appreciate. Yeah, this is going to die really quickly. Our go is going to go. So the main issue we've got is the air raid air units, but we're in dive over to fly. There we go, he's down, Argo is gone. Now to figure out where this drone is, it's apparently right above us. There's one. I was going to say, I is shoot. Hi. Seraphin said, I accept you as you are, Velaskia. Much love. Much love to you too, Seraphin. And told me to repeat as many times as I could, but I knew that was going to be a bit of a waste of time. And where are they going? The wing diver likes to fly around a lot. Like, get blown around a lot. There's a gasoline chat, guys. Exclamation mark, poke catch if you want it. The close range weapons aren't actually that bad, but plasma ramps are amazing. 2000 damage per hit, doesn't even have a bad recharge. Great. Finding out some stuff about the wing dive right over here. Okay, I have no idea what happened, but you know, it's fine. And I just remembered what I was going to wind up about, about her first, uh... Hey, I saw a video, which I was watching earlier. <laughs> I would recommend it, guys. It's a good series if you like, like. Oh, here we go. She can explain it. Oh. By the way, I guess we're even. What? Om nom nom wallpaper. That was great in the middle of a cinematic area. Yes, that makes us even. Me in the middle of your first AI Somnium final video. With, you know, can I'm a Darth. Can, can I'm a date or whatever his name is? I can't remember the first name. Don't you mean date? Can I'm a Darth. Can I make date? That's what you called him first time. So I thought I'd wind you up about the two things so far. This is 
Did we? What? Yeah. Was it on the old computer, like the old unupdated one? Okay, that's why it was lagging. I was thinking, is it normally like that? I don't think it is. But, so now we're playing with the M3 Rapier Frost. And that worked str straight away. We got blown away. I love robots. But it's like a machine gun, so uh, he died. Maybe it's true. No. Okay. Why? Okay. No one came to the door, but I didn't answer. No, this is why I think that just comes over the bus and it's not going to Did they not think it was weird that we didn't have a letterbox? Because it's a back gate. <laughs> Delivery driver, eh? Oh, there's a bloody big structure there. Would you mind just clearing that window to the end of the building? Um, I'll do it when I get a chance, just remind me. You'll know up to date where I am by me saying I'm getting blown up at the moment. There has been one of those days. I tell you what, I'm pretty good at the wing diver in air combat apparently. Just not with some of these weapons. Apparently all the practice on like flight simulators is how. Because I'm pretty quick at killing drones. Where's he? There he is. Oh, there's a big green. I don't think I've ever been hit by one of them big green blobs before. We just managed it. How rude, Mr. Argo. Yeah, I thought I thought it was just the ranger that had trouble dodging the Argo. Turns out, uh, even the wing diver struggles. Can shoot you out of the air. It's great. Well, I definitely can't. I definitely can't dodge. Considering I'm using close range weapon, I've got no chance of dodging. Even if I tried to prove a point, I couldn't even dodge with this weapon. Right? Oh, the capacity is 600 as well, nice. Oh no, don't tell me he's gone and done that. You pain in the ass, Argo. It's only gone and stood out the area. It's cheating. Pain in the ass, though. Yep, he is. Well, Indiana Coney's has decided to sail the seas forever. I'm gonna blow my building up anyway. You're laughing at Okay. You know you have major poison. It's a dummy poison. <laughs> uh, I hope Seraphine didn't hear that. Oh my god. I just decided, you know what, I'm going to jump on its turret. No, it shot me in the air again. Nope! <laughs> Seraphine just said nope! Oh, you pain in the ass. Can't get close enough to hit him. Hearing is too loud. No, no, she said. For Indiana, would it be a daddy voyage instead of a maiden voyage?
Oh, I'm stood on his turret, yes. Can he even hit me up here? I bet he can. No, he'll just move his turret. And slap me against the building. And now I'm spinning madly out of control again. Has he moved back out of range even further? She, she's um, spamming the ban hammer in chat. Well, the hammer in chat. That's what, what happened. At least I've got a fight. At least I've got a way of fighting when it when it's out of bloody range. I've just got to try and balance on its cannon. I hope it comes into range at some point. Marvelous. This is a bad idea. Damn it. He decides to do that straight away, just as I'm about to go. And hit it in the cannon again. This the joys about doing these tests with short range weaponry. Oh my god, can you stop slapping me out the air, please? 22 hours and 30 minutes to go, here. I'm not even planning to do this at the 24 hour stream, so I've been your fine. Even um, the last year's AI Somnium files was longer than any of these a bit. In one go, anyway. Thank you, Redonculus, for the epic fire balloon bust on the battlefield. Very much appreciate. Slap, 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 slap. That, that's why I'm not. But there is your episode. Sometimes just a few hours. I know that's why I'm only doing one weapon test a day at the moment. Because I don't want to just do one thing. Obviously, that's not fair on the rest of you. It is a variety stream, so... Oh, you... Bugger. The Argo is a pain in the ass today. Won't bloody come back. Oh, has he come back? Can I hit him? No, he just bloody shot me again and then moved backwards. What a pain in the ass. Let me stop shooting me when I've got a chance to shoot you. You big pain in the ass. Eee, that's probably why you're in the head. Dead. But we've still got drones to deal with. And one of them's coming for us. Where is he? There he is. It's alright, so everyone. I wanna. I've noticed one thing though. You know the uh, thing I've got? You know the fact that I put um, Streamlabs so it gets rid of all the exclamation mark commands? It's not too much... Uh... <laughs> it doesn't come up on stream, which is beautiful. So all that's coming up on stream right now is do not forget the battle, do not forget the battle. No one's going to have a clue what's going on. <laughs> Yeah, anyone watching the YouTube videos, now you know where all that stuff's coming from. That is in-stream commands that are hidden. I know I'm in the middle of it. <laughs> right, here we go. Let's see if we can mop these guys up quickly. Probably not, because this thing is very short range. Irian forgets a lot. This is why it exists. Yeah. Royal Mail came to the front door. So, yeah. Even though, shouldn't we just change the name of it to the mail? Just take the royal part out. <laughs> hey, get out. Stop being behind me. You little bitches. Nope. Oh, that reloads so quickly, it's great. Oh, I don't have the power. Give me energy! There we go. Eee, that's the M3 Rapier Thrust test complete. 
So now let's do the stream raiders battle because you guys have been waiting patiently. <laughs> Let's get the battle done. <sighs> You're late on break anyway, aren't you? Yes, I am. <laughs> so we had quarter past twelve. How well your day is going? Mm -hmm. Almost 3 p.m. here. Yep, almost 2 here. Right, special congratulations and thanks go to Seraphin, 200 gold, Indiana Cones for 3 times Musketeer Scrolls, on one of my favourite names, Paul Wanker for times 2 Musketeer Scrolls. I think Velasquez we'll is just laughing now. You up? Who's on what? Don't forget to check. I won't. I'll check in a sec. So let me start the frozen lake battle so people can place their units. Well, that's what I do, isn't it? Did you recently add something in the top left corner? Uh, not that I know of. Why, what's happened? What's happened in the top left corner? I'm quite scared now you ask that. I see my avatar. Oh no, that's always been there. You've just... You've, um, you're in, um, stream boss. You are the stream boss. That is your reward for getting your ha 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 and stuff. Hello, look, seeing a flash of it again. Was it like a card or something? Yes. They actually figured out what a front door is, they just didn't knock. No, it wasn't. They tried to go in the back gate, obviously, then decided to walk around, find the front door and post it through. So, there is a spin rack in chat, guys. Exclamation mark poke catch if you want it. And we'll get the next weapon sorted. Right, yeah, well, I'm going to let you go. I do. Have you got any plans for what you probably want to play later, if you want to play anything later? We'll see how I feel again. All good, all good. But, um, if we do... Think of a pirate song you want to sing if that is the case. Sophie wants to hear a pirate song, and you're better at lyrics than me. She can lead the way. <laughs> yes! That would be great. Oh, why? You're going to change the lyrics? I'm, I'm sure you can fit Daddy in that song a few times. Uh. Yo, yo, yay, yeah, yay! Yeah. We don't need no quarter. <laughs> oh, I can sing the Seaman song. Deploying. Select mission. So next is the MX Laser Lance, which is bright pink, or purple, mix your both. Louis two, have fun, and try and have a good rest of your day. So now we're actually getting through the weapons quite quickly, which is good, because we've got a load of them still to go. And this one does 900 damage, so... We've got, we've got to that point where the robots will die very quickly. Seraphin, you've reminded me. Go to Kyo if you want to do your um, combat now. Because you're level 200, so you can go to Kyo. For your combat skills only, though. If you want to get everything else, you're better off getting that first. 
But yeah, any combat skill can now be done in Kyo. I noticed yesterday, because I was checking to see if you were... If you'd gone back to broken or not. Damn! Because, I'll be honest, I got into a thing of um, checking on Mike. Because of all that time he kept falling off the fishing boat. Because it's good like that. So yeah, now your combat skill, you are on the second best island now for combat. But obviously you'll have to go back to earlier islands for your fishing, woodcutting and all that lot farming. That's it though. You can you can train any of the following on Kyo. Heal, magic, ranged, and all of course. Oh my god, this takes forever to reload. I found the issue with this weapon. So yeah, I was supposed to, well it was like, for you it would have been like 3 o'clock in the morning when I realised this, so I can't really tell you. I was tempted to put it in chat, but you'd probably not get it, so... I decided to wait until I remembered to tell you. Because my memory is that good. So this lance is powerful, but has a really bad reload. But I think it's just Argo now. Let's kill him. Yeah, that's, that's what I thought, so I didn't put it in there. This laser lance takes so long to load, to reload. Wow. But at least this is what, like, 9,000 damage that I'm going to be dealing to it. So on the next reload, I should kill it. As long as I don't miss too many shots. I can't really find an easy way to stand in the middle of Argo while I'm waiting for this ammo to reload. Argo's down. Oh, I've got to get better with this gun, wow. Takes forever to reload, yet I'm missing every shot. Let's not do that. I mean, I can change weapon, but then it's not really a weapon test. <laughs> Monster takes less time to reload. try and shoot them and then just miss all the shots.
There you go. We got to wait anyway, so. But yeah, I always keep an eye on Rainfall and see how you look and benefit. And I'll always do that. I'll always try and keep you in the best location I can. Thank you, Seraphin, for the double epic and the eye bomb on the battlefield. Very much appreciate it. It came up this time. Stream raid has been nice. How is everyone's day going anyway? I don't think I've asked yet. How are we all doing? Bravo! Bravo! Oh. Didn't realise that one was right above my head. There we go. Normal weapon test complete. That was the MX Laser Lance. So now we can tell the weapons are getting more powerful, but that one is mid range. And no, I will not cry after I've tested her fin. <laughs> Thank you, Indiana Caramonese, for the epic big head might be MX for see on Battlefield. I don't think I thanked you for that earlier. So I'm thanking you for it, for it now. Are you even human, Arian? Uh, that's a good question, isn't it? Oh, we've got a plasma whip. Hey, come on, we've found Indiana's weapon. <laughs> Inspector Cajone's plasma whip. What is accuracy L? Wow. Interesting weapon. Yeah, no. Can 2500 capacity, rate of fire 60, 2 times 10 damage, 75 range. Charge time 2 seconds, energy cost 120%. Large! Deploying. Select and select I don't entirely know if that's what it means. Uh. This is headquarters. Argo is coming. Scared? No way. So, this is the Plasma Whip, guys. Let's see how this goes. This is why I do these weapon tests, because of these interesting, weird weapons. Okay. It's an annoying rapier. That's what it is. Annoying rapier. And it literally fires everywhere. It doesn't fire straight, it fires in every direction. <laughs> That's what it means by L. It just makes pretty col colours and fires in every direction. It even, it even fires behind. So basically we can go stand in the middle of the Argo and just fire. Put the robot down. Take out this guy while we're over here. Accuracy! <laughs> yep. Accuracy. Lol. That's what the L stands for. <laughs> I mean, this is probably the kind of weapon for me, because at least something's going to hit. There's no point in me even getting close or anything, because it just... 
just fires everywhere, no matter how close I am to the target. Is this how your whip fires, Indiana? Darko did not like me trying that, did he? <laughs> oh wow, it just drained my... Yep, we just let it recharge. And it just absolutely drained all our energy. in its leg because that's like the best place to get it. I mean it's getting through it quite quickly, it's just unfortunately about to stop. It didn't even move that leg yet, it still managed to stop us. What a pain in the ass. Attacking the air units is going to be great with this weapon. Against the robots it's fine. Against the drones it's going to be a nightmare. There we go. Speaking of which... Oh no it's not actually. It's pretty good against them. I should just go through the middle of all the drones just firing it wildly. It's like some weird Gundam move. There's a clever in chat by the way guys, exclamation mark poke catch if you want it while watching me just wipe out all the air units by just flying near them. Problem is it's such a waste of ammo. Uh... Say maybe the EDF can wipe out before I do. Nope. There we go. So that was the plasma whip, which just basically makes us into a shiny pink star. Pretty effective if you're surrounded by enemies. Plasma whip's probably great for running into a massive army of giant insects. You just Put that on, just fire out every single direction. So now we've got the Laser Lance C, which is 1200 damage. Wow. And the charge time isn't as ridiculous as the last. 30 second charge time, no wonder that was awful. Wow. But yeah, we're getting much more powerful weapons now. Now it's getting ridiculous. Select a difficulty. Which is good, because it obviously makes it a lot quicker. That's the problem with these weapon tests, they take a while. Because there's a lot of weapons in this game. 788 to be exact. And we've only done the ranges so far.
And we're probably testing an average of like 25 weapons per test. On average. The Air Raider's got like double the amount of everyone else because he's also got tanks, so... So that's all the robots this side already got. I'm just getting used to going close with this with a wing diver just for these weapons because we're not going to have any with an amazing range. I mean the range on this one is not terrible. That's all the robots now. It's not going to be able to hit him all the way over there though. What does it do? 2,000 damage or was it 1,200? In which case it'll take about 10 hits of this. It'll take about 10 hits anyway I suppose. Is he smoking yet? No, he's still up. So yeah, I'd recommend AI Solomon file files for anyone that likes puzzles. And storyline that is all. It's going up on YouTube at the moment. There isn't a full playlist yet. It will be in about five days. So anyone in the Discord will pretty much get that in a the Discord videos. <laughs> the Twitter is the Twitter is just below. I think. I think all the. Uh, links are somewhere. <laughs> so where is Twitter? Now that's a good question because unlike other people we don't We try not to do that too much. Join our silly Discord server. <laughs> Turns out Seraphine is our advertiser. I would like to say follow us on Twitter, but I mean, uh, I don't really post a lot on there. Lasky definitely doesn't. It's near enough automated of when the streams go live, that's about it. True. Okay, this is not great range. But it was alright range. Ah, yeah. It's not that Twitter is the best or something. <laughs> like Mike. And it'll be fine. <laughs> Trying to say so. <laughs> EDDF took out the last one. So that was the Laser Lance C. It's another successful test. I think I want to like. What, uh -uh. what am I trying to say? <laughs> Fun people. 
Of course, I'm joking. Right, so next we've got the freeway lance. Which... Is kind of going to go badly, I think. Okay, follow me. <laughs> yes, everyone follow Seraphin on Discord, on Twitter, not Discord. That don't think you can follow anyone on Discord, technically. Seraphin does a load of good musical things. And loads of performances. At places like Hyper Japan. Wow, I just got battered in the air and battered on the onto the ground. That's Freak by Michi K. Me Troop may be a raging bee in community games. Link to this channel. <laughs> yep. I think I put up one post recently and that was the one about Saint Tro. Because I felt like people need to know that you need to uh, get past a certain point before you can actually join each other. Because there's loads of websites that are giving false information saying that you can join each other straight away, which is a lie. That'll be the last actual manual post I posted. Before that, I don't know when the last manual... Oh, the man last manual post before that will probably be advertised in 24 hours. Which should also be on Twitter. I might need to put that on Twitter, actually. I might not have done that. Because it doesn't auto-post. Thank you, MC68K, for the epic vampire lord and that field. Very much appreciate it. Because that, that tweet is obviously automated. <laughs> I shared a complaint. <laughs> What was the complaint? Oh, is this horizontal firing? I heard it say so horizontal, didn't it? Or vertically. Not horizontal, that's the way. Hey, 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 I goes down. Now to try and take down all the air units, which is going to be easy with this weapon. Not. You know what would have worked if you put the hashtag, hashtag Saintro in there? Might have got some response in <laughs> True. <laughs> I didn't think about that, I just copied and pasted it from Facebook. Uh, I forget how hashtags exist, surprisingly. <laughs> it's my compliment. <laughs> It's like you put it in a legit, ex a legit complaint. Have you, s have you seen my hashtags? <laughs> Here you see my hashtags. Oh, I hate these drones. This gun is. On range. Out 
out of energy. Oh, there we go. Back up. Yeah, so if you guys want to see someone fun on Twitter, follow that link that Seraphim put up. Go and follow Seraphim. The <laughs> Seraphim has a lot going on. And he's very talented. Shit. What do you mean, shit? Now I have to start going at him. <laughs> just do what I do, just make a lot of it. Uh... There we go, number one done. Freeway Lances. Successfully test complete. Oh, and because I changed the um, title on my phone now, so it changes after stream starts. That's why. That's why that title came up. Because <laughs> now I do all the. Um, Custom tags. I share my new articles myself, not automatically because it didn't work well enough for me. Sometimes I try to think of a more promotional text. Now, I'm not that professional. <laughs> I'm not good at that. There's a wild shell in chat, by the way, guys. Exclamation mark poke catch if you want it. But yeah, criticism received. Oh no! Please stay as you are, Hurrian! No, I don't want to be professional, that's not fun. I like how you are all like yourself. Oh, thanks, Seraphim. Oh, yeah, I know. You've got a big smiley face at the bottom. Yeah, because I don't know if I can actually change it, like, straight away, so... I'll just leave it as the day before's title and that, and it'll change just after it starts. I don't know if I can change it before, I could always try that. I'll try that tomorrow. But I know it's not serious, but... Once, once the uh, Twitch tags get saved and stay saved, that'll be nice. That'll probably be an update that I bring out. It's the problem is keeping them tags on there. Right, so special congratulations and thanks go to. But now you have a new follower. Thank you very much, Sophie. Very much appreciate it. So special congratulations and thanks go to Indiana Cajones for two f times three warrior scrolls and Seraphine for healer scroll. Congrats and thanks, guys. Now on to the next chest, which could be anything. Got an unknown chest. Let's see what it is. Hopefully it's not a bronze. We've had enough bronze. Let's go on Q. Let's see if we've got a Centurion Berserker or a Mage ready. We have got a Berserker ready. We haven't got a Mage ready. So we're going to go with our big bad Berserker. Do share the program or the 24 hours. 
stream on Twitter though. Yeah. I'm guessing you just mean the 10 to 10 because we don't even know what we're playing ourselves. <laughs> Can't put a games list out, we don't know what we're playing. Uh, as usual, we adapt. <laughs> like we're doing at the moment because we don't even have a schedule at the moment. But the schedule is pretty much going to be Earth Defense Force to start with. Then it's going to move into 2D Tuesday, Wheel to Wheel Wednesday, first, first Person Thursday, etc, etc. That's the plan. Well, you can share the announcement of the 24-hour stream already on Twitter. Yep, with the link to the donation page. Do me a favour, Seraphim. Actually, no, don't matter. I can actually do that on stream. I was going to say, make sure to send me a message to remind me, but I can do it right now. And it won't even be that bad. <laughs> All the smiley faces. So we're ready with the MX Rapier. We're going to start the test of that weapon shortly. There's no worries there. There we go. Now that should be done. Now to make sure. Yep, done and dusted. Ah, just a link to Facebook. <laughs> I mean, it shows a little bit of the thing. I have no idea what I'm doing. <laughs> I'll be honest. 
I could probably organise it into a proper post later on. Ah, true, it is fine. <laughs> Thanks, Sophie. Very much appreciated. <laughs> Green! We've got green lasers. The MX Rapier has green lasers. Ow. Nice. Don't want to be kicked. Aw, oh, no, this takes forever to reload as well. Afternoon, KT Potato, how's it going? Another one of them beautiful weapon tests. Oh, do you mind hammering me? Give you a big rocket launching weapon. And the one gun. Dive! There we go. Oh no. Is the Argo off the map? Hmm. We're gonna find out. We've got more and more robots to kill though. It looks like he might be. I might have to shoot his cannons again. At least he's quite far away, so he might actually move closer. He's a bit too far away at the moment. How is it going today? There is a raid in chat, guys. Exclamation mark raid to join. Oh, God. Let's help the EDF soldiers take out these guys until we get a chance to actually hit the Argo. At that moment, we can't even get close enough to hit the Argo. thing is, is actually close enough to fire. Can't even see what I'm shooting. There we go. There we go. Saying there we go we'll, for a while as I wipe out drones waiting for the big guy to come closer. I don't even know if I can get to his guns yet. I literally can't. Three. Three. I could have shot that drone then.
Hang out. That just exploded in my face, or did that actually shoot me? There we go. Hello. It's <laughs> missing completely. After I've wiped out all the drones, if it's still not close enough, we'll do what we did last time. We'll reload, we'll go straight for Argo, ripe them out, weapon test complete. So at least once we ride the drones out, we can just go straight for him, because then we wiped every single combination out. We just can't hit him at the moment, because he's hiding out of range that I can actually get to. He likes to hide yeah. off the map. No. Okay. There is a wild cocooner in chat. If you guys want it, exclamation mark for catch to catch it. Okay. DDF took out the last one. Let's go see if we can actually hit him. If we can hit him, that's fine. If we can't, then you know we start. Oh, you pain in the ass. Yeah, I still don't think I can. Especially now he's turning around. As we can only get here, his weapons won't even come out close enough. Yeah, when we start that, we'll take him out. Then that's that test complete. Hopefully he stays in the arena. This is the problem with a short range, short range weapon test, because he just likes going out of the arena. And it was bad enough with a ranger. At least now we've got a fix, just restart the mission, take out the Argo, job's done. Obviously that's going to be hard, because uh, it's robots. <laughs> he didn't like me being on his leg joint, that's for sure. That did a lot of damage to him though. That worked out well. I mean, unfortunately, it annoyed him a bit. But he's already dead, so that's the weapon test for the MX Rapier you already done. Job's done. Retreat. Another weapon test successful. Right, next weapon. Here we go. Got a burst lance. Wing Getting there. Two weapons. These are all the quick ones now. Deploying. Select, select a difficulty. We'll probably find something like the plasma whip at some point. That weapon. This is headquarters. Argo is coming. Oh, let's stop singing. Where's the Arco gone? Or is he gonna drop straight on my head? Whoa, okay. Nice. Oh, 
Oh, he's dropped right there. Wow. Let's take out this one on the back then. And then we'll get him from behind. Okay, Argo's down. <laughs> like I said, we're getting some ridiculous weaponry now. <laughs> now we just need to take out all the drones. It's the hard part. At least the most annoying part. I mean, if they could make a Gundam game like Flying Wing Diver, I think that'd be pretty cool. Oh, there's the last one. I don't think we're going to get to it somehow. We might. Yeah! Managed it. Right, so. I mean, this isn't going to be as long as the grenades test. All the special weapons tests, luckily. Them two are a nightmare. This is going actual quite quick because they're easier to use weapons, even against the masked robots. So this time, the, the problem is them being short range. That's the only issue we're having. All the rest of the weapons are probably going to be pretty good. Um, so next we have the Rapier G, G Frost. And 45, 9 times 6 damage, 400 capacity. Not the greatest range, but at least we know it fires pretty much straight. And most of these weapon tests are taking what, like a couple of minutes now? About 5 minutes? It's just clearing up the drones, it's usually the pain in the ass task. Already? Argo is really annoyed. I don't know yet. Oh, it's another beetroot favourite. Squeen! Oh, 
One more hector to go, if I'm not mistaken. And there goes the hector. So let's go for Argo. Let's take him out. Let UDF take out some drones while we take him out. Heck, Argo's down already. This is how ridiculous the weapons are getting. So now it's just drones again. This is the only lengthy part of testing these weapons, is taking on the drones. But, the reason I'd stick with it, is because at least we can fly. Luckily we got a bonus against drones. Just because of that one change. There we go. Thank you, real, real mum of Baron, for the epic peppermint bomb on the battlefield. Very much appreciate. No, no. Might have ammo as well, marvelous. All very high at the moment. I managed to take out about five, but I didn't keep an eye on my energy. But I'm pretty good at that. Got it. Get one more. That was the last one I was going to get. So I need to wait for some energy before I go for my last assault. Sure. We're not going to get the one all the way over there though. There's one behind that building or something. Alright, here we go. Let's start, see how many we can get. One. Two. One behind me. Got it. No. <laughs> <laughs> Tried. We can finish him off now, though. There we go. Got him. So that's the Rafi AG Frost. Also, test complete. Like I said, whipping through them in about five minutes. That was only five minutes. So you can only think this is going to get a lot quicker. So we've got the Laser Lance X next. Which does 2,700 damage. So, about eight hits on... Um, well, actually, it's less. It's less than eight hits on Argo, so... The robots will go down one shot each. Argo will take about seven shots, I would imagine. That's just quick maths. Maybe six, even. Depends, though, we just missed a robot at like, point blank range. Yeah. <laughs> 
So, did we blow each other up? Yeah, we did. So one more robot to go. He's getting ready to shoot us as well. Damn it. All the time for screen shake to happen. We're gonna get him, he's gonna go down. Boosh! The drone got in the way. Marvellous. <laughs> oh, drones. Sometimes they're not usually a pain. But that one was a bit of a pain. Right, we're gonna use the same tactic. We're gonna bite his kneecaps. Ow! I'm fainting on top of it. No! No! Bollocks! Bollocks! Oh. I knew that was coming. There we go, R goes down. We were pretty much right with our guess. The thing is, with these later weapons, we might actually get some with a good range, a good-ish range. There is a Kabuto in chat, guys, if you want it. Exclamation mark, boat catch. Catch it, of course. So now we've just got drones again. He... Absolute enemies of short range weapons. Skun has no flaw that we know about. It does, it's short range. That's a big flaw. EDF are shooting some down. I'm impressed. They're doing a good job. Trying to shoot that guy while he was right underneath me. <laughs> this is quite hard actually. Still, I would definitely play a Gundam game like the Wing Diver in this game. Um, battle time. Battle time, daddy. Ain't no five minute test. See, they're getting quicker. We'll be through this in no time now. So. Let's put the next weapon on for now, but we're not going to go into the battle, of course. So next we've got the Rapier G Frost 2. Ah, oh, no, we've got the Plasma Whip 2 coming up. And we will do the Stream Raiders battle. So let's get us going for another high ground. Thank you, Seraphine. It's very much appreciated. <laughs> Keeping us all in the know. Are you sure? <laughs> yes, I am sure. Because I'm very forgetful, you know this. Just making sure I don't forget the battle.
There we go. Special congratulations. Thanks for the gold chest. Go to... Wow, we got a gold chest from that. Lovely. Seraphin, two times Vampire Scrolls. Nermic for a Berserk Scroll. And Katie Potato, three times Flying Rogue Scrolls. Congrats, guys. And we are going to go for yet two more gold chests. We planned this well. So we had a bit of a bronze mess around to start with, but I made sure we'd get something good at the end. So let us play Centurion and then we'll grab the um, quests. So I'm going to place him that side because he doesn't really have a bonus either side, to be fair. I'm going to put him this side. Thanks for helping out. And we're going to go back, claim our quests. There we go. Three times his egg scrolls for that one. Kill three enemy. It's fine. Oh, okay, that was just a daily drop. So now we need the mages. Kill three epic enemies. Kill support units. And what so? What fourth and what fourth? So let's drop it back into view for that battlefield. And hopefully take another five minutes to kill some more, or less than five minutes. Let's see how the Rapier G Frost 2 goes. Deploying. Select, select a difficulty. Because the quicker we get in, the quicker we get it done. So that's the thing, I'd rather play a variety of games, but at the moment. <laughs> I am determined to get these weapons less done, and soon I notice so many of the damn things. Ah, oh, you! Pain in the ass. You hit me at the same time. I'm not doing that this time, mate. The machine gun one's fine. I just need to get closer. Can't really avoid the machine guns. I don't know what's even happening. What is even happening on my screen at the moment? I don't know. Well, there we go. <laughs> We're going flying across the screen again. Oh, I'll take this guy out. Since I'm close to this guy, let's do it. I should have really shot that drone while I was there, but you know. And since we're back here, why not? Let's take out Argo as well. I mean, the plan to sit on his legs so he doesn't shoot us. It's hard. Oh look, that robot's coming for us now. The tactic has worked and we've already killed Argo. Argo destroyed. So now it's just what? One shielded robot and a bunch of drones to go. I missed that one. Didn't miss that one though. Oh, I got it just. I didn't think I'd manage to get that one. Need to learn how to reload, obviously. Oh, you can't land on top of them. I never knew that. I was going to try to in one of the early missions, but I decided not to because I didn't need to. And now we actually know I can't land on top of them. Yeah. 
can't see anything. I just need to stand in a window apparently, because they all make their way to me. The weapons down, the weapons out. Out of ammo. That would have been great, we'd have got a few more kills then as well, but. Ah, I was so tempted to jump then. Uh, uh. They're just dive bombing me. Whoa, they are literally dive bombing me. That one's not getting away. We got full energy now. One more to go. Dance. <laughs> That's Rappy AG Frost. Two. Successfully test. Complete. We now we've got Plasma Whip S. Weapons. And still costs a ridiculous amount of energy. Wing divers can equip two weapons. Deploying. So select a difficulty. So I wonder what colour our amazing star lasers are this time. Is there a this is headquarters. Argo is coming. At least you know it would be more powerful, so. Argo is already scared. It's already. This time, apparently. Oh my god, it's a lot better range as well. It kind of made it ridiculous. So ridiculous, I don't even know where it's going. the leg. Wow. Oh. I was hoping to take out both the Argo and the robot. Pick my witch, let's do it. Smoking quite badly. Really do anything, I've got no weaponry, I've got no uh, energy.
not too high. If they're not too high, I can take them out pretty easily. So drones are pretty easy to take out with this. I know what I need to do. gonna run out of energy so I mean we took out a massive bunch of them just by doing that. There's a B high M in chat, exclamation mark, poke catch if you want it guys. And there we go, Plasma Whip S has been successfully tested. Test has been a success. B he M, exclamation mark, poke catch, gonna catch B true, la la la. Mission. Gotta be the very best. Can be true, never was. Wow. Demonic Lance. 115,000 damage. It's gonna one shot everything. It's got an alright range. And it doesn't even take that long to recharge. <laughs> that will kill Argo in two hits. <laughs> so if Argo gets in our way, we're going to shoot Argo. Hopefully he doesn't decide to go off the screen again like usual. I wonder. No, he's transforming. We can't take him out when he's transforming, unfortunately. Is it also green? I think it's also green. Can't see the laser long enough. Pretty sure it's green, but I haven't seen it. Twenty hours to go. Luckily, it's not going to be that long, Seraphin. It's all right. Stream pass will be on soon. We're getting there. Hiya, big boy. Okay, we were too far away. The problem is it's very extremely short range. Oh. Get up, get up, get down. So you can tell, already smoking hard. Yep, there we go, R goes down, two hits. Now for this big guy down. Problem is, this laser is going to be a bit slow at killing these things. Especially with how many times we miss. And the fact that even 90 isn't a good range for this. So even though that damage is very impressive, it drains a lot of energy. So the drone battle itself, we can kill about three. But luckily, the odd one comes down to say hello, like that guy.
Well, there isn't many that check that giant. They pretty much need to be on top of us for us to take them out. Still better than most of the weapons, to be fair. So most of them don't even have this range. That one wasn't actually in range. What? Oh, did I shoot it through the hole again? That sometimes happens. They've got a little tiny hole at the front that for some reason I somehow shoot through quite often. There we go. Two more left. She can't do anything about the moment. There is a raid in chat, exclamation mark raid if you want to join. Uh, failing party, yeah pretty much. That's just me failing to this one drone. There we go, we got him. Right, so here we go. Let us change equipment. We're going to go for the four-way lance. Which luckily doesn't take as much energy, but... Oh, and it's got more capacity, so that's a plus. Short range, though. We really do not have many weapons left. I feel like we might have two more Stream Raiders battles, and then we're done with EDF for today. Until tomorrow, but we'll have longer range weaponry tomorrow. So, all the weapon tests from after this one should be a lot quicker. Should be a lot quicker. Just with this one being the short range one, this is the nightmare. So, I do apologise, there's going to be a lot of EDF. Yeah, it's going to feel like that, so everything. I apologise. <laughs> Don't worry, it's only like 700 more weapons left. Nah, I think we've done like over 100 weapons to be fair. So I think we've only got like 400 weapons to pop probably do. Maybe? No. Probably more like 500. Sigh! <laughs> Not only one day though, luckily. Hey, you'll get to see Velasco in some of the tests as well, to be fair. Because she'll be needed for some of the um, awkward, more awkward tests. Uh, thank you for the double epic and the eye bomb on the battlefield. Very much appreciate it. So the Argo's already down. And I think most of the robots are already down. Yeah, Blasky will be in stream later on anyway. Yeah, Blasky will be taking part in some of these weapon tests. Because it's something that requires two people. Ha <laughs> ha! 
got any of the rest. <laughs> At least this one's better against drones. Ignoring the wink. <laughs> yeah, I noticed that after I said it. It's like, ah, oh, I see. I mean, how can you not? How can you not hear my annoying voice? I see how it is. <laughs> I never ignore you, Seraph, and you know this. But I try not to, anyway. I accidentally ignore chat sometimes, when I'm really concentrating, but I try not to. Luckily, that's the good thing about Earth Defense Force. So I don't have to concentrate too much on these weapon tests. Unless it's grenades. Then I think it's all concentration. Oh, he went underneath me. How bloody close do I have to be? <laughs> okay, we've got four more to go. Let's reload. We've got one shot left, and there's like a ton of them over there. And we've got one coming this way. Nope. I tried. Thank you, Rebike, for the epic plasma tank on the battlefield. Very much appreciate. I'm pretty sure I thanked Seraphim for a double epic and DIY bomb on the battlefield, which I'm also appreciating about. Just in case I miss them both. So I, I I'm trying not to miss anything in chat, and I miss. I know I missed that one at least. So next we've got the Plasma Broom, guys. The Plasma Broom. So we're going to try and sweep the enemies off their feet. Off their feet. No problem. Which are going to try and brush them aside. Deploying. So select a difficulty. <laughs> Irian just placed an epic plasma broom on the battlefield. He, that he did. <laughs> okay, I think it's like a machine gun. A very close range machine gun, but a machine gun nonetheless. Ah, uh, it's an upgraded. Wow, stop shooting me. I sweep them off their feet. There we go, that's one swept off the feet. It's not one swept off the feet. Sweep one more off his feet, then we can go for the sweep Argo off his feet.
He just kicked me! Wow! Oh, he just kicked me! Help me! I oh, like it helped him. That goes down. It's time to sweep up the enemies. Sweep up the last remaining ones. Too many enemies. Ah, there's a colas. Colossal, Coloss Colossal in chat, exclamation mark poke catch, that one took me longer than it should have done. I don't know what I even said the first time, but Colossal. Colossal. Yeah, I got it in the end, so thank you for trying to help me. <laughs> Eventually I got there. Congratulations on your colossal. This way I realise I don't have it, but you know, I'm busy. That's busy sweeping up all the opposition. Apparently I've got that one actually. I never know what I've got and what I haven't got. Thank you, Stroomy, for the epic mistope sauce for Zerk on Battlefield. Very much appreciate. Come to me. You absolute. Pain in the ass. All right, so there we go. Plasma broom has been successful. Has had a successful weapon test. Next, we've got the. Master Rapier. Oh my god, it's got the accuracy of an F. That's gonna go well. So this is gonna be a fail. Choose loadout. Wind divers and then we've got five more weapons after that. But we do have Stream Raiders Battle coming up in like 20 seconds, so... We'll get ready for that. Six, five, three, two, one, boop! The battle is ready, my lord. Congrats on your green orb pet, Seraphin. I mean, it's probably like your 75th, but 
So special congratulations and thanks go to You thought we'd lose? Nah, we had that easy. Easy peasy. What do you mean the raid? Raids aren't too bad, it's the dungeons that are the worst. So special thanks and congratulations go to Seraphin, 50 gold, Indiana Cones for 3 times must see scrolls, and Katie Potato for 2 times flying rogue scrolls. Graylin will be able to win a lot more soon. I'm getting to that point where there's no point in my character sailing, and sailing is just going to be on the weekend. Or maybe night time. I don't know yet, I haven't figured it out. But we're going to do Slayer throughout the day when we're streaming. That's the new plan. But we just haven't started that yet. That'll probably be next month. I shouldn't say that, because next month's in like two days. <laughs> right, let's smack down a berserker. Right next to S Priest Lucio's birdie. Thanks for helping out. And let's go on to our next web test. So that's the thing, once I've got all my characters sailing 999, don't need them sailing anymore. Ever. <laughs> Apart from skates from island to island, so... I may as well just help you guys in dungeons and whatever, like, constant. Then I can leave them on the island. Don't have to worry about swapping them in or out or changing... I never have to worry about getting sailing again, that's why I've done it. Deploying. Select a mid select a difficulty. I can help you guys with never having to worry about getting sailing up. It's the main thought process, especially while we're not getting really good loot from the uh, raids and dungeons yet. It's coming straight for me. Wow. I mean, it's not as good as a plasma whip. Doesn't fire anywhere near as crazily, but... I say that, it's doing quite well. I don't know why Velaskia doesn't use these. It's insane. I might have to recommend my own videos. Uh, Velaskia is used with Wing Diver. Just in case anyone wondered what our reference is for. Wow. Problem is, the range is very short. I don't think this thing's as. I think this thing's quite energy efficient, by the way. I 
say that now, it's not. What I should just do, I should just stand on a tower each time. They do seem to come and die for me, or at least attempt to. Ah, come on behind me. One miles down. And now we can go for the rest. Sorted. No victory dance. Let's go for the next one, so that was the Master Rapier. Next we've got the Laser Lance Sigma. Oh my god, it spins. It, has, it possesses enough raw power to destroy an enemy weapon with a single blast. Just not the, the Argo, pretty much. Maybe you can blow his leg off, but I doubt it. Yago is a little bit too resilient for that. This is headquarters. Argo is coming. Argo will take four hits for this one. Wow. Juggling me. I think I missed my shot. Give him the fuck then. The Argo is behind. The Argo is. Argo is down. Argo destroyed. Get them two robots down. Oh, well, it reloads really quickly as well. Pretty good. Now it's for drones. See enough to be able to shoot anything higher than me. We need to get up the roof. Oh, 
my roof to be able to see everything. They're trying to ram me again. Don't let him go away. No! He got in the way. Yeah, no! There's more access in chat, guys! Exclamation mark, boat catch if you want it. I feel like I found a way of doing anti-drone. What am I looking at? Hey, you found something out, what have you found? That these drones are annoying. Ah, oh, you have killed it before I could even get there. So, I did check if I had this Pokemon, I did not. Okay. I've thrown out a dodgeball. Ah! Oh! Very nice. So that was the Laser Lance Sigma. Choose loadout. Wing divers. And next we've got the Master Rapier Frost. Choose loadout. Wing divers can equip two weapons. I feel like I have the system. <laughs> yeah, I do. I mean, if it's a if it's a book on their end, it's not really your fault, is it, finding it out? To be fair, you can also check your extension in it. You can see in there if you've got it as well. Um, I wonder if you can try to catch it with a lower ball, and that's why it lets me throw multiple balls, maybe. I don't know. So this is the Master Rapier Thrust. Argo is coming straight forward again. Well, we're coming to the last few weapons, so it doesn't even matter. He can do whatever he, tr he can try and do whatever he wants. As we can all tell, the weapons have got to a ridiculous level now, so. Might throw us around a few times, but he's ours. So let's go shoot this last robot, and then we'll go for Argo. So here comes the Hector. Don't see us coming. Oh, now he does. Unfortunately, I ran out of energy. Now we can get him. Got him. Now for the Argo. Argo's already down. Ah! 
Can't see what's going on, I'm just getting dive bombed. everywhere. There we go. There's the one. Alright, time to get him. We've lowered the number. The rest of them are going to be a bit harder to get. I was going to say, let's see if I can get them all at once. I don't think I can. Ah, oh, yeah, I can. Beautiful. That's the master master rapier rapier frost completed. And next we have got the sacred lance. And then we've got two special named ones. One of them does six thousand damage. So here we go, Sacred Lance. That is quite blindingly white. Deploying. Select a, select a difficulty. So let's see, can we get these for free? Successfully test before the stream raise battle, we're gonna find out. I'm guessing probably not. In fact, his toy went through the wall, it helped me shoot him then. So it's because it's a uh, horizontal, not vertical. There you go, that's all the robots but one down. Just our go to go. And our goes down. That was my goal, I made it. I killed two on the way. Ok, 
Can't see. No! Off the edge. So the Sacred Lance has been, we've had a successful test with, two more to go. I think that might be the longest category as well, oh no, rocket launches, range attacks is the longest category, but the short range one is quite long. That is one of the longest ones, but luckily with range attack, it's going to be ranged. So, <laughs> we're going to have advantage of actually being able to shoot across the map. So we've got two more weapons to join. We've got Lunotar, which we're testing out now. And then we've got another one which I can't remember the name of. Okay, so Lunatar seems to be a lot more spread out than the last one. I had a few drone opportunities there, that should have really took, but you know. Prioritize the robots quite a bit. Plus it could take two shots for us to kill this robot. But it's not going to. Right, where's Iago? There he is. We don't have enough power to dodge. My god, he's running. Come on, get him. Oh, he escapes the area. There we go. Okay, so the range isn't great. Managed to get ourselves on the roof. Now we know how to steal the drones, we're going to do this every time. We're just going to sit on the roof. Pull them in this way. Saves us more time and effort. Say that, it's still a nightmare to hit them. I'm above my head. Super above my head. 
know if this is really short range. Okay, there's one coming through the building. Ah, oh, there's another one coming through the building. There's one going over the building. There is a Volcarona in chat, exclamation mark poke catch if you want it. Right. I didn't see this one go above us, so we're getting it. Taking into the fact that Lunatar seemed to be pretty terrible. Alright, so here we go. We're gonna go for the Hraidmar. The Hraidmar is the last one. Yeah, 45. It wasn't that great. So now we've got the long range one. One of the ultimate weapons whose use was prohibited because of its overwhelming firepower. This laser lance used a lot of energy to boost its range. In fact, it has the longest range of any lance weapon and its destructive power to match. Choose loadout. So this is basically the longest ranged weapon, and thank you Seraphin for the double epic and the eye bomb on the battlefield, very much appreciate So one of the questions of was it green? No, it's kind of bluey, greeny thing. Shake is awful. There we go. Now for the big one. I wouldn't even deny I was trying to take out his weapon. He destroyed all the good buildings. Pain in the ass. I gotta find a better building then. Nope. Didn't have enough boost. Just wiped out all my hiding places. Blue! Fly blue. That's what colour the lance is. I have to go in then because they're not coming this way now.
basically the air support for a little period of time. A very short period of time. right next to me. There's one underneath me as well. Oh, wow, that one's miles above. Oh, we nailed it. So that is luckily you can all s and have a nice sigh of relief. That is the last weapon we are testing today. So that is the entirety of the short range weaponry. And you can already tell mid range lasers are a lot lower. Mid range electroshock, a lot lower. Particle weapons, cannons, a lot lower. Sniper rifles, lower. Range attacks, there's more of them, but also no longer range. And then there's less homing weapons, less special weapons. So that is the worst one out of the way. So I'm happy to get out of the way. Van screw time! I can't, I can't do Velasquez's voices. I can try. Alright, so there we go. Let's get the battle going. Let's not keep surfing waiting too long. So here we go, we've got 90 units all ready to fight. And do not worry guys, that is not the end of the stream. Because now we'll have stream pairs coming up. You guys get to join in the fun and test your memories. That's if you like testing your memory. <laughs> This was Seraphim's favourite game at one point. It took almost 24 hours here, and no, I'm bad at that, aren't I? I'm going to have to make sure it doesn't take us on next time. So, special congratulations and thanks go to Katie Potato and Seraphim for a Monk Scroll, Shock True and Revelt for a bomb two times Bomber Scrolls, and Lazy Links Media for times two Shinobi Scrolls. Congrats, guys. Let us continue on to the multi boss chest there's even going to be a bigger plus of the fact I'll go quiet at some point during this because that time of day oh we don't have enough time for that no? uh, so we're going to throw our volatile buster down because we've only got we're actually down to <laughs> our rare units I've got level 30 epics, level 30 bronze now to get the, uh, the uh, rare ones up. So let's switch the game. So we are going to go to this next one. Twitch. Thank you, Real Mom of Baron, for the epic peppermint bomb on the battlefield. Very much appreciated. And you guys will need this. This is a um, mirror, so you don't have the lag that I have, basically. Or stream delay, for that instance. 
I'm assuming it doesn't really have many problems. Right, so luckily that's the stream, that's the test done. We can quit that. We can switch the window capture. 